Hi everyone, Linda here. I'm an independent Sensi consultant. Welcome to my YouTube channel. I received a parcel today and it was my party closeout. Uh, so I have some things here. I wanted to share them with you. It's not a ton, but it's enough. It's all the things I wanted. Um, anyway, I wanted to start before I get too deep into it uh, and just, you know, sort of mention that I do highly recommend that people uh, get a party going. Now, um, uh, most of the consultants, I think, do this. We open a party on our website and then when we order, we order through our party. And some consultants have their, their uh, customers order through their party and uh, support them that way. But um, you can also have a party on your consultant's website that you can order through. And at the end, you just, I, I'm opening, as soon as I closed this party, I opened another party. And I have this party, I'm not even sure exactly what the length of time is that you can open it for. And they, and Sensi, of course, does recommend that you keep it, you know, short and sweet, but I never do that. <laughs> um, the party I just opened is going to be open till mid-February, so all of December, all of January, and half of February. And um, you can close it early. If you accumulate uh, enough credits, half price credits and, and dollar credits, and you want to close it, or even if you just say got one half price item and a, some, you know, a little bit of credit and you wanted to spend it, you can close it. But I'm going to leave mine open. I, I plan on having another sip and sniff sometime before the catalog changes and um, I'll put some things through. And what I typically do with my party, this, this whole party is just for me. But what I often do is I'll have half price items and I'll let all my girl gang know, hey, I have some half price items. Uh, does anyone want to take, you know, take advantage of it? And I offer it to them. And some of them have bought warmers for half price. Some of them have just gotten six packs for half price. So I'll do that again this time. I mean, there's only so many things I need, <laughs> you know, that I that I need all those half price credits. Cause I usually typically go until I have four half price items and uh, you know, a reasonably substantial, um, although watching other people's videos, I, I definitely clo don't end up with this big uh, dollar value cause some people haul some great stuff. I'm okay with that. <laughs> anyway, for my girl gang, if you're watching this video, keeping that in mind for February-ish, you know, the end of January, uh, we'll close the party and you guys can have some of it. But uh, but the rest of you, take advantage of that. If you're going to order, have your consultant set up a party, order through the party link, and then when it gets to a certain point, you can ask them to help you close it and then order some items. It's a great, great perk. Highly recommend. Your club doesn't count toward a party, though. It has to be a purchases outside of the club. I mean, you get, you know, as consultants, we get credit for club purchases, but we can't, it's not part of the party thing. Anyway, I'm rambling on here. I, I won't take up any more time. I just wanted people to be aware that you often watch us do these videos about parties and maybe some of you aren't really sure what that means. That's what it is. If you're spending money and you, or maybe you have a mom and a bunch of family members that also want orders through and you, or you have friends, you know, your party link, you can say, hey, go to this party link and order through my party link. Anyway, enough. <laughs> I'll get started here. Um, as I've mentioned before in other videos, when I go close a party, this time I had four half price items and I had about $110 in credit, Canadian. And everything is more expensive for us Canadians compared to our American friends, <laughs> just as an aside note. Um, so anyway, I, um, I, uh, this, I sit and do the math, you know, which one of these things, am I better to get this for half price or am I better to use the credit, the money credit? Should I, what should I, you know, I want to, you still have to spend money on the half price items, right? So I try to keep that dollar value as small as I can and use my, uh, dollar credit to purchase things that are going to would cost me more at half price. Am I making any sense? <laughs> anyway, I did the math for this one as well. <laughs> and uh, keeping in mind that in Canada, I live in Alberta, we don't have a provincial sales tax, but we have a, a federal tax, the GST. 
And when they're charging tax on your party clothes, they're charging it on the full value of the item, not what you paid for it. So just keep that in mind. But anyway, so that's what I did. I did math and this is what I got for half price. So let me start instead of rambling on here. What I always do, almost always at a party clothes is grab a laundry love bundle. And the laundry love bundle is the scent, uh, the washer whiffs. Uh, these are scented uh, washer crystals that you dump into the into your uh, washer before you load it with products or clothes rather or sheets or towels. I use this on my sheets, towels, beddings, um, you know, patio blankets, uh, things like that. I don't use the scent, uh, the washer whiffs on my clothing, but that's just a preference. A lot of people do. Anyway, I'm using Fluffy Fleece, which is a uh, red currant, um, cozy musk, and heliotrope. And it's a lovely winter cozy uh, fragrance. I use Jammy Time as well. I love that one, I, uh, but I like this one for the winter. So I'm gonna use this this winter. And actually, I'm doing my sheets today and they're in the dryer right now. So you put a couple scoops of this in. Then it comes with, the bundle comes with the laundry liquid. Now that looks like a really small little bottle, but you put the pump in and the instructions on the back. And as I mentioned before, I always put it, uh, in, write it on here so that my guests can see, you know, two pumps for a small load, three pumps for a medium load and four pumps for a large load. And so this does like 50 loads. You, you're, you're, it's the same as a big jug of, you know, something else. But this laundry liquid works really, really well. I was a skeptic. I tried it. Even things like, you know, kind of dish cloths that can get a little, you know, you wash them and they're clean, but they always look a little dingy after, you know, they they have really perked up even in the, with this. And it's, I usually even sometimes do a little pump onto a really bad stain. So it's really a good detergent for sure. And so that comes with it. So you've got the washer whiffs, the big tub, this, and then you get two packs of these dryer discs. Here we go. <laughs> two two uh, discs in each pack. It takes me forever to use these because <laughs> they never seem to run out of scent. Anyway, you just throw these in the dryer. They don't do anything. They're not like static control or anything. They're just scent boosters. You throw them in your dryer. And then after they start stop losing their scent a bit, I, I typically stick them in a drawer or something. So there's two that come with that. Now, another product that's part of the laundry system that doesn't come in this bundle but you saw me haul it in my last club in out club i used a half, my half price item for it and that is the uh scent soft it's the fab fabric softener in the same scent in fluffy fleece so i have all the pieces now for my laundry um, my other half price item that i got was the cleaning bundle that's a bathroom cleaner counter clean and dish soap and I did get the bathroom cleaner in squeeze the day oh dear well oh, you can see lemons <laughs> squeeze the day this is a lemon I haven't tried it in lem in squeeze the day before um this is a bathroom cleaner uh it's a little I'm a bit cheap about using it um it's more expensive than I like even in a bundle um mm. I got it for half price, so that uh, immediately helps, right? I got the whole bundle for half price. I think that it's thirty four, so you know it's it you know it's it's not it's more reasonable for three pieces at half price. Um, but I still I go through it so fast. So what I've I've altered my my routine. I don't like like um, grocery store cleaners because they're so harsh and they're so strong and smelly. I have to open the bathroom window when I use them like scrub free or, um, scrubbing bubbles, you know, um, those sort of cleaners. So, um, but what I do now is I, when I'm doing a major clean, you know, tile, everything I use, you know, say scrubbing bubbles or scrub free and clean my bathroom, open the window you know, I'm usually washing the floor in the whole nine yards when I'm doing it. But in between, um, I use this. Um, I live in a 1950s house 
and it has a main floor washroom and I also have a, a guest washroom downstairs. So I have two bathrooms, no half bath or anything like that. I used to have that in my um, old house in Edmonton, but I don't have it here. Um, so when my company comes to visit, they're using my main loo. <laughs> so before they come, I like to spritz things up, the sink, the tub, just, you know, make sure everything looks, you know, pristine. <laughs> So that's when I dig this out because the smell of this is much nicer and it, if you have a lingering scent, it's gonna be squeeze the day, not that harsh chemical. So I use this as my spruce up and I use a, you know, a, a grocery store type cleaner in for my main clean. So that's how I get around the expense of this. Sorry, I think I'm going on a bit about that. Um, the counter clean is really nice. I also picked that up and squeeze the day and that's going to be a uh, actually a stocking stuffer for someone. But uh, I do use it. I have two on the go right now. I have one in my laundry room because I do spray spots with this. Um, my niece did try it on uh, her uh, uh, an antique kind of velvet thing, and it lightened the, the fabric a bit. So you have to be really careful, I think. But it does work. It takes stains out, blood stains off of pillowcases. I've done that tons of times. Um, so it's... It's great. I don't use it on my counters because I have quartz and it seems to, you know, leave us sort of a streak. But I use it in my stainless steel sink. I spray that and clean it. I, I've used it on like stick uh, cookie sheets that had a little, you know, were a little difficult. I just sprayed this on, let it sit. And then after dinner, washed it off. I've used it on spots on, you know, my floor. I've used it on, like I say, um, fabric. I've used it in my camper, in my car. It's, it's a great, it's a great cleaner all around. So that's the counter clean. And then I did get uh, dish soap in. Oh gosh, the light tonight. There we go. It's in uh, vanilla mint, and this is the one with a really cute sort of seasonal. Oh, my camera is being really difficult. There we go. Um, Usually I go through my dish soap faster than my counter clean. So I, I'm using this dish soap now and I have the counter clean on the go. I'll run out of dish soap before that. So I thought I'd haul the dish soap and then I can continue. I will probably tuck it away in December and use very snowy spruce and then come back to that in January. So I got an extra one. So that's a three, uh, th three product bundle. And then I got it for half price. So all of those things were a better deal that way. Then I wanted to get um, soap, hand soap. So I ended up getting the Christmas Trio. There's three of them. One is Christmas Cottage, one is Perfect Peppermint, and one is uh, Winterberry Apple Tea. Um, I usually, I'm, I'm selling Scentsy, so I'll be honest here. I usually uh, buy it at Bath & Body Works 5-4. You know, then I often pour it into my um, uh, soap dispenser. I have a decorative soap dispenser because I, you know, if I don't like the bottle, I don't want it out. But, uh, and it's usually, you know, if you buy it and then you get a, coup a coupon from uh, Bath and Body Works, it's such a good deal. And I find this a little pricey for what you get personally. But with this trio and then getting it for half price, and these are scents you can't normally buy the hand soap in this, these scents. And I'm having some company at Christmas, so I wanted it to, to have a nice soap downstairs and I wanted to have a nice soap upstairs. And they've made them, I don't know if you can see, but they've made them very festive looking. I haven't had these new bottles. I only had those little stubby ones before, so I'm, I'm excited to try it. Look at the perfect peppermint is a, a nice one so I'll just put these out so I splurged on that and said and so now I don't have to go to Bath and Body Works and get soap <laughs> anyway what kind of sensey consultant am I <laughs> um, the final thing that I purchased with my half price credit is um, I think I'm trying to decide which one I did get I think I did get well I'll do this one one of these two <laughs> the next two you see Fragrance Flower and Luna. These are 21 Canadian, so I got it for half price. They last a long, long time. And right now I have very snowy spruce going in my bathroom. 
And so when that's done in the new year, I'll put Luna in. And I had Luna, I've had Luna before. It's a really nice bathroom scent. And then I'm actually gonna go grab a room spray in January and and have it in the bathroom. So I love Luna. It's just like a sandalwood and uh, it's floral, but it's got a, a nice sort of hint of, you know, um, of a musky sandalwood. Oh gee. That sounds terrible. <laughs> Let me just look up Luna here. <laughs> Sorry. Luna is jasmine, sweet pea, freesia, and sandalwood. <laughs> Musky sandalwood. Anyway, that's my fragrance flower. That was half price, and that was a great deal. So then I had used up my half price items, and that would have been a really not, you know, too much out of pocket. And then I did use my um, my dollar credits for a warmer and an accessory. And the accessory was um, the Birchwood uh, Cord Concealing Stand. I love these. I have them. This is all, I mean, Sensi, if you're listening to me, you need to make more cords concealing stands in other, you know, formats. I think they have two. And that's it, two or one, maybe it's even one. Um, and uh, for me, this is my aesthetic. I like the Scandi kind of natural and it, and it really, you know, it's deceiving from far away. Some people at my house come and touch it because they wonder what it is. And I do have a lot of wooden bases that I set things on. So this fits me perfect, but I know my daughter-in-law had said, I wish they would make something in like, you know, gold or silver or, you know. <laughs> So anyway, I think they need to make something more, but I really, really like these. You, you can conceal your cords so that you get the switch right cl up close to the, uh, to the base. But I also use these for other things. Just as a side note, um, I have a Christmas, if you watch my, my uh, home tour, I have a Christmas village and I wanted to elevate a couple of the houses. So I set them on here. I sometimes put a Bath and Body Works candle on there if I want it to look pretty. I've set other things, you know, other lights or, you know, anything on there. So it's a great little thing to have just as a decor item as well. And you can always hide these little notches at the back. Anyway, I wanted another one because I put them under almost all my warmers and I like them to look the same. I have different ones in here and I have different ones in my bedroom, but Anyway, um, my last thing is a warmer, and it is uh, one I've had my eye on for a while, and uh, they did the bundle deal for November. It's the Polar Panorama. This is an expensive warmer, so that's why I use the dollar credits. It took up almost all of my uh, dollar credits. I think it's 86 in Canada, if I don't quote me on that, but, and it came this, this month, they've done it for September, October, November, and maybe they'll do it again for December where you got the warmer and then you got to pick a bundle of four bars that were free. So you just pay for the warmer and they have different warmers at different price points. This was the most expensive one. Um, so you don't have to get an expensive one. Uh, you can get something a little less expensive as well. And you can pick between uh, holiday, um, bakery, is that what they call it? Bakery, I think so, and fruit. And uh, the fruit was sold out for a while, but I see today that it's back. The bakery bundle is sold out now. And then the holiday bundle is as well. But I do see on our workstation that they're bringing the holiday bundle back on uh, tomorrow, the, they'll be bringing it on the 23rd. I'm filming this on the 22nd. Although you guys won't probably see this until next week because I have uh, several videos stacked up waiting to be released. <laughs> anyway, enough of that. I'll show you the bundle. I did pick the bakery bundle and um, a couple of these I've never smelt. Uh, the first one is um, custard apple and it's a green wax, and it says pineapple, sugar cane, mango, and custard apple, which is interesting. It's a nice lime green, or bright kind of apple, green apple 
and I can't smell, I can't smell, I mean, I guess I can smell a bit of fruit, but I smell mostly, um, it smells like green apple to me. It says custard apple, so I hope there's a little bit of creaminess. If not, I could always add something to it, but it's in the, you know, a bakery bundle, so it must, it must be delicious. The next one is cutie pie cupcake, and a lot of you guys have got this one. I have several bars of this. I don't have it in my club. It was from the Bring Back My Bars, and it's just clementine yellow cupcake vanilla icing. It's really nice. It's a nice, like, bakery, very sweet. Got that clementine really comes out, and it's yellow cake, and um, yeah, it's a good one. I, I have it tucked away, the bars that I have now for the summer, because we get so few nice delicious bakery in the summer so i want to use mine the next one is huckleberry apple pie never smelled this one before apple huckleberry and creamy vanilla i could smell apple apple pie it smells a bit like apple pie yeah maybe the huckleberry comes out it smells like an apple pie the spice, the cinnamon, just like an apple pie. So let's see if the huckleberry comes out when I warm it. So it's huckleberry apple pie, but it does smell like a apple pie. And then the last one is walnut raisin muffin. I got this in another bundle um, as well, not long ago. So I have two of these now. It is. It, it was in the catalog for ages. It's a baked muffin, like hot from the oven baked muffin and cinnamon golden raisins and some walnuts it's a spicy like when you're baking muffins it's not uber sweet it's just more like a spicy muffin and you know muffins they're not quite as they're not quite cake but they're yummy so it's a really cozy scent for the winter anyway that's my four pack and then I did get my polar panorama this is right up my alley I'll try not to break it here it is um, it's on a black base. It is uh, got trees here all the way around. It looks white when it's not turned on, which suits my decor. I have two black low back uh, leather uh, uh, just field couches in my living room. You guys have seen from watching my tours. And so I love black. Black is my favorite color, or I guess black isn't a color, is it? <laughs> I, I love black it's my favorite as you can tell uh, so it's perfect it's perfect for my living room I'm not gonna put it in there now because I have it all done for Christmas but I will be putting it in there in the new year and now I'll probably put this down in my family room uh, while I while I'm waiting <laughs> anyway it's an element warmer I've heard it's a really good performer and it should be because it's 18 watt I'm I'm, be, I'm beginning to really love element warmers really they're um, they do so well because they heat up evenly and I find they're, they're a little slower to heat up and then they heat the dish and then the, I find that the oils dissipate more evenly and actually slightly more intense because they're not, you know, it's not a flash in the pan type scent. Anyway, the dish is quite nice and it says four on it. Oh, actually it says five. Wow, I've never had that. Yeah, it says five. So you can put five cubes in that for optimal performance. Anyway, it's it's lovely. Just even by it like that. But when you turn it on, now I don't know if we'll be able to see it. Let me turn it on. Um, let me turn my light off here. Look at it. It cycles around into different colors and all the way around. I don't know if you can see it has that northern light. Um, let me see if I can, and you can see some of the trees that you don't see when it's not lit in the background. So they're inside and look at it. Oh, it's so beautiful. Look at it. And like I said, look, the trees that are in the background. Oh, oh, oh. And I know it's going to do well. It's going to be a great performer. Oh, I can't wait to show my husband. Anyway, that's the Polar Panorama. I am so thrilled. I've heard really, really good things about it. 
And even in a, you know, even when you can't appreciate all of quite all of the Northern light feature, it's still pretty with the different colors, you know? Well, hard to see now. Anyway, that's my haul. That's my party haul. And so if you open a party and have it and order through your party, you can sort of have, like what I typically do is I often will start thinking about it, you know, uh, in advance, sort of what I would like to have and sort of have a goal in mind. Anyway, girl gang, think about it for the end of January, beginning of February. <laughs> anyway, that's it for me. Uh, I wanted to share that with you so I can put it away. And um, as I mentioned, I have several, when you're watching this, you've seen the other two that are now parked in YouTube waiting to be released. One would have been um, a haul, I think, and then the second one would be my warmer and decor Christmas decor tour. And it's gonna be Thanksgiving for uh, my American friends this coming Thursday. And then they, I think they parlay it into a whole weekend thing, you know, with people traveling and whatnot. So I was thinking it would be fun to release that video the tour video on the weekend and then this one will go up probably the week after and then it's going to get difficult to do uh you know more videos i mean i plan on i do have um i do want to stock up on one more set of bars or a couple more sets of bars and then i think probably as consultants we'll get access to the bring back my bars early so that might be in december as well i don't know i'll watch dan orchard's uh, Facebook um, uh, video uh, and see what he says. <laughs> so you'll see me again, um, but uh, it, uh, wait and see. Anyway, if I do get the Bring Back My Bars early, I'll do a cold snips. I usually order the whole set and then share them with you guys. So anyway, that's my haul and um, hope you enjoyed it. Again, think about it if you want to party. And, you know, not, you don't have, I, I'm not recruiting, but I'm sure all of you have consultant you order through. Anyway, that's it for now. Um, take care. And um, please, thank you so much for subscribing to my channel and watching my videos. And please do tell me, uh, you know, what you're the most excited for from, you know, for the Christmas season. Like, I think I've asked you already what your go-to scents are. So, um, you know, what warmers are your like favorite that you're excited? I'm sure, do you guys put the tree up or some of you maybe don't celebrate Christmas. Do you do something festive in another fashion? Like that would be interesting. I'd love to hear that, you know, uh, to hear what other uh, people that, you know, celebrate other special occasions in this time of year do, you know, to make it special. Anyway, I'm rambling. <laughs> I'll sign off. Thanks so much for watching and we'll see you later. Bye.